Okay, so when you've drawn a part, this is for instance our burner. Um, if I right click on it, I can move it around. And if I want to change the color or the appearance of the part, you right click on the part around here. So right click on that. And then you go to edit appearance. Click on that. And then you get a palette of different colors. So you can make it uh, like green, purple, whatever. Or if you want to make it kind of a metally aluminium color, you can go for these colors. And then just give it a green tick. You can also move this around. That will give, um, say it's a see-through plastic that you use on the part, you can move that around to give it a bit of opacity or like see-throughness. So we can play around maybe a brass color like this and then you can give it a tick and then you've got an almost see-through color. If you don't like it, right click on it again and then you go to edit appearance. I'll just do it again. So you can click on different colors. We can go a little bit darker. You can go to darker colors here. Um, can go see through so there's lots of different um, colors you can custom colors uh, you can click on that and um, so just I'll just do it one more time you go to the part right click on the part edit appearance and then you can change the colors as well if you want to um, if you like that color you can just use that so aluminium or whatever you want to but if you want to um, change something you can right click on it as well and edit it and it will make that live again see i i right click it on my um revolve there so i can do another revolve or i can make changes to it if i want to so i will just go and then go and revolve it again and give it a green tick so um this side of the screen is quite important it gives you all the steps and if i hover over the step it shows you the steps that i that you took so see if i go to the revolve one it will highlight the revolve that I used um, and so on. So you guys can have a look at that. Uh, that's all for this video. Thanks.